Do, 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 do. Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's video. Hope you're doing well. I'm just going to make a tweet. Sorry that I'm late. I sat down to record XCOM like... I'll just, I'm just going to do a quick... I'm just going to do a quick XCOM recording. And then they're never... They're never quick. <laughs> they're never quick. So... I don't know what I was thinking. But uh, I got it done. I got it done. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I ruined ruined the sketch. <laughs> Sorry, man. Sorry, man. What's up, Thomas? Hey, Bill, you. Fragile. Devin from Alberta, dude. I feel you. Uh, you you probably know this, but I I used to be uh, well. I'm from Saskatchewan, originally. So I totally understand. I totally understand Western cold weather and like the plains cold weather. It's much different out here because here it's more like more wet. If that makes sense. It's more wet cold. Whereas back home it's dry cold and you feel the wind because there's no buildings. <laughs> there's just cows and wheat. It doesn't provide a lot of wind blockage. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm from i I'm from Saskatchewan, eh? Yeah, exactly. Drove through SK when I moved here from Toronto. Oh, cool. BC boy, born and raised. Love that. Love that. I love it. Do I plan to just do a full LP without streaming for Dying Light 2? Because streams tend to pull you away from the story. Uh, I don't think streams pull us away from the story. I think if anything, streams sometimes help because... If you're unsure about something, you can bounce it off chat real quick. Maybe it pulls you away from the story. Maybe. Hey, Unib. Caught me watching part one. Oh, awesome. I hope you like it, Samuel. Uh, we had a good time yesterday. That was really enjoyable. My internet cooperated. That was sick. Didn't drop a single frame. Hopefully those technical issues are, are behind us. Yeah, we can finally see our, our outfit choice. <laughs> uh, the main menu, yeah, we look good. We're, we're like pretty jacked, actually. We're pretty jacked up. <clears throat> what happened to the Campfire Andromedas? Uh, nothing. They're on that shelf back there that you can't see right now. See that shelf back there? They're on there somewhere. But, uh, yeah, I just, I've been wearing these a lot because I haven't been streaming very much. And these are so comfortable. These are like sleeping in pillows. <clears throat> Picked a good time to get COVID. Ooh, sorry to hear that. I actually just got my booster today. So I'm like, I got my, everything's boosted. I feel pretty good, actually. Some people were saying that they had a bad experience with the booster. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> you want a shelf tour? Well, uh, it's mostly books. My floor. Let me see if I can show you guys something without unplugging stuff. You can see back there, there's some Lego on the ground. That little mask in the corner. That actually looks really creepy from here. That's the uh, We Happy Few mask. And then at the, t at the top of the shelf is uh, the smaller AT-AT walker. On the floor is an unopened large AT-AT walker. We gotta get some, uh, we gotta get some Lego streams going soon, you guys. Would you guys be down for that? I loved it. 
I love those Lego streams. Like, I really, really enjoyed it. It was very calm, it was very peaceful. I have some ideas on how to make it cooler, like, cinematically. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I, th I think Lego streams would be super fun. <clears throat> Please say hello to my son, Dane. He loves watching you. Hello, Dane. Dane, be nice to your mom. <clears throat> Lego streams are chads. We're all chads here. Uh, Mother's Day quest you guys really wanted to do yesterday. So we're going to do that now. Brecken suffered a head injury and is having seizures. He needs medication, but all the anti-seizure meds in the city are gone. Lena told me about a man named Ghazi. He's a bit challenged. Apparently, he's been stockpiling anti-seizure meds for his mother, who's been dead for years. Appreciate the content. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Taylor O'Sullivan. Thanks for the membership as well. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Okay. Are you guys ready? Are we good? I think we're good. Let's find Gazi's place. I do have some... Well, okay, there's two more exclamations that have popped up. I'm pretty sure we cleared all the ones we had previously, but let's see. You Alfie? That's me. Electricity. Building maintenance. I keep this place running somehow. Glad you're here. I was just about to call you. What's the problem? Well, it's good news, bad news. <laughs> the good news is that you restore the lights in the Cauldron District. The bad news is that it blew out the grid near the overpass. It's blacker than your pants pocket over there. So, do you need it switched back on? It's blacker than your undies. Flick, flick, you switch them on. The order doesn't matter. Then you throw the master in the main station and it'll light up like a Christmas tree. I think I can do it. Of course you can do it. Any runner could do it. But there's a catch. Shutting off the lights has created a little black patch for the volatiles. Bunches of them are gathering there after sundown. So I've rigged a trap. Oh, cool. It's already in place, all set to go. Now, if you can get in there and restore the power after it's dark, we can fry a whole lot of freaks in one shot. After dark, that's that's gonna be a lot dicier. Sure. Yeah, it is, and that's I'm why into no it. Once volunteered for this job, but I'm thinking maybe you're a bit tougher than the rest of these guys. Just an impression. Let's just say I'm here to help. Really, good intentions, huh? Hope you've got some guts, or you won't last long. What's the worst that could happen? We die. We die and we try it again. The other exclamation's gone. All right, well. <coughs> sneak you, sneaks, <laughs> sneak you. Thank you for the nine months. Taylor, thank you for the super chat. Congrats on all the gains, Christopher. Jawline's looking rock solid. <laughs> Thanks. Crane, can you hear me? Jade? Yeah, I copy. Something wrong? No, no, it's um... Listen, Crane. We all appreciate what you're doing, and I know you're doing it to redeem yourself, because Amir died saving your life. That's part I'm of it, yeah. It because if we don't get antizin from Rice, people will start to die. You know, I met Amir right after the outbreak. I didn't know him for that long, but he was the best, most decent man I've ever known. But I just want you to know that I don't blame you. Amir knew the risk. And Crane, we know that you two are taking a risk to do this one. They don't care about this? I, look, Jade, we'll talk when I get back with the antigen, okay? Okay. Just, just come back in one piece, alright? Is that enough to kill them? It's enough to kill one. And one is bailing hard. What was going on here? That might have been some type of robbery that I could have maybe helped with. Oh, patrol member escaped. All right. Fragile, thanks for the nine months as well. Lots of uh, YouTube membership babies. That's cool. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. 
<laughs> I probably don't say this enough, but uh, I'm very lucky to be able to do this for a living, and I really appreciate all of the support from you guys. It means it means a lot, and I, I probably don't say it enough. So thanks. Thanks for being cool. And enabling me. Ooh, look at this dude. What the? We got big hammer bros to just walk around like this? Please upload Dying Light on YouTube. We're, we're playing on YouTube right now. Kristen, thank you so much. Thanks for the super chat. I've watched it for years going back to We Happy Few. Best part was you in the house with all the screaming old ladies. Never laughed so hard in my life. I remember that. <laughs> That's hilarious. I actually uh, just got a text from uh, Guillaume Prevost the other day. He's the guy who owns Compulsion, who made uh, We Happy Few. Hey, wait, is this a... Jeez. Caught me off guard a little bit there. Is this a safe house? It might be. I love that. I love the throwing stars. Hell yeah. Yeah, he messaged me the other day. He wanted to put me in touch with a company. <laughs> minor burns. That's doing like a, a strategy game or something in Montreal. So that could be neat. But I'm excited to see what their next game will be. Buddy. No respect. There we go. The stun is kicking in. Okay, to me it looked like this was an area where it was like a safe house, but and it, it kind of looks like a safe house. Is there anything I need to do to kind of say... Oh, I probably have to hit this. Yes? Sort of? Clear area, turn on power, secure the entrance. How do I secure the entrance? Oh. <laughs> Clo I'll close the door. Close the giant gate. How about? Why don't we just close the giant gate? Cool. Alright, cool, cool, cool. So I learned yesterday that we need to look for collectibles in the safe house areas. There we go. Nice. Daniel, thank you for the Lights Off membership, dude. Thank you guys so much. Teresa as well. Thanks for the super chat. Can't play scary games for the life of me, but I love to watch. Thanks for being one of the best. So, uh, yesterday you guys were talking about Visage and how I should play Visage. And, uh, I, uh, part of me worries I don't have it in me anymore to play those games, like... I feel like, um, oh, this is far. And I'm going to be going through this dark tunnel? I don't know about that. Hold on.
Oh, jeez. It's so brutal. I love it. And that, the reason I thought that was we were watching um, we're watching a new series called uh, Archive 81 on Netflix. Just started it yesterday. Super good, but it's it's a little spooky, and I'm not sure where it's going. And uh, it just kind of made me think, like, I don't know if I could play Visage right now. I don't know if my if I could handle it. Yo, Mac Telecom, what's up, man? Okay, I am out of here. You know what this reminds me of? Um, this tunnel reminds me of Days Gone. The motorcycle zombie game. I actually really want to replay that. On PC. Is it actually, is that game on PC? Does anyone know? Don't look at me. Yo, how am I getting over here? Am I just gonna... There we go. Yeah, it is, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'd like to replay it at some point. One of the ideas that I had, um... If mama ain't happy, nobody's oh, found him. happy. So you better make mama happy. Gazi? Me too. We <laughs> have the same name. Are you from the video store? No, my name's Crane. Crane? Crane rhymes with train, and brain, and sane, and grain, and rain, and plane, and the other kind of plane, and, and... But can I come in? No, no, it's impossible, impossible. This is my special day with mom. It's Mother's Day, and it's the most important day of the whole world. Are you from the video store? Why do you keep asking me that? Uh, because you're supposed to bring my movie about me. It's called... Charlie, and it's all about me, and how smart I am. Oh no, Look, guys, Gazi. if I bring you your movie, will you let me come in? Sure. Then you could watch with us. It is Mother's Day, and if Mama ain't happy, nobody happy. Oh, and and she also wants chocolate. Mama wants chocolate. No, no, no. Wait a minute. That's too much. Don't argue with Gazi. It doesn't work. That, that's what the drugstore. Oh, I don't say. like it. I don't like it. I. Oh, I now, 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 nothing better happen to Gazi, okay? Nothing better happen to him. Agility. Okay, so I got the slide. Vault. Jump over enemies. Press space while running an enemy to execute. That's cool. A drop kick. Knock down enemies with a running drop kick. Press space while running to jump and could... Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll drop kick. We're drop kicking. Awkward guinea pig, thanks for the membership. Very kind of you. Thank you so much. Bjorn, I art directed a CG trailer for Days Gone. What? Dude, that's sick. Is that what you I guess that's what you do for a living? You're an art director? That's so cool, man. Do you work for the uh Do you work for the the developer or do you were you kind of contracted out how does that work uh what i was going to say before is one of these one of, one of the ideas i've bounced around for the past <laughs> year or so is um doing what i would like to call streams for sleep or something like that Oh, 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 go. Oh, this. 
Okay, hold on. I need to Molotov. I need string, man. I got one right on me, don't I? Come here. I don't know if I'm going to help that guy very much. Uh-oh, we are in a bit of trouble. Oh! I'm using the absolute worst possible weapon. Sleep! Are you cool? Yeah, I think I think we're cool. Hello? Thanks. That animal would have killed me for sure. I wonder if I might have to get a reward from him. Let's see, hold on. Yep. Alright. Sorry, we ain't got we don't got time to talk right now. It's motor. See the smoke? What the frick? I don't know why that guy is floating, but he is. Was it already looted? Yeah, the Molotovs. The Molotovs are where it's at. That's... That's insane. Now, I don't know if I might have still been late or something, but... We'll see here. Oh, no. Awesome. So these just seem to happen randomly as far as I can tell. Disaster relief on-site package? How come I can't, uh... Oh, there we go. Deliver drop to quartermaster. Get to the airdrop as fast as you can before bandits get there. Yep, okay, cool. I'm into it. So, streams for sleep, or something to that effect, right? Where, you know how, you know how people go onto YouTube and they look up, like, you know, thunderstorms or whatever? This is just... This would just be... Gaming, no talking, long, long-form content, like three hours of just playing a game not talking. Sure, you could look up, like, you could look up, uh, non-commentary playthroughs. But I don't think they're specifically aimed at sleeping. He's dead now. Holy jeez! <laughs> what the frick? I feel like... Is this guy giving off some weird, uh... Poisony vibes? Oh, 
Oh, you can hold. Whoops. So you're kidding me. <laughs> wow. That's cool. I didn't know that was a thing. Charlie, Charlie. See you for Charlie. Found gotcha. it. That is really cool. That is very cool. Okay, what do we want now? As your body gets more athletic, you're able to absorb more damage. It's probably a pretty good option. Throw any melee weapon at enemies, dealing massive damage. Double tap right mouse button to aim, then press left mouse to throw. I guess this would be good if you're, like, at the end of your weapon's life. I'm going to just take this to absorb more damage, I think. How does this work? We just get access to this at 5. Okay. Let me get rid of this. Let's bring in the brick hammer here. And I think we have some upgrades. Assassin. Better handling, sure. Oh, I don't think I applied it. Cool. Okay. Try this bad boy. Can we go at the back? <laughs> Run? See ya. Hey, Zero, what's up, man? There's definitely an audience for those sleep streams. Yeah, I mean, I think it would be a neat idea. Um, I'm just trying to create some space away from this guy that's chasing me right now. Wow. I'm in big trouble. Oh no! That's where you can see the Canada too, actually. You can see the outfit. I mean, I can't fight all of them. What? That's cool. Get the special box of chocolates. Oh, it's probably in that garage there. Go. <laughs> chocolates, chocolates, chocolates. Coffee shop. I've literally hit the jackpot here. There we go. I think we're laughing. Oh. Yeah, this is the right place. <laughs> Arlo, what's up, man? Thank you so much for the super chat. Thanks, dude. Can't stake some on call for Google Prod Security, but I hope you're having a nice evening. I'm having a great evening. Thanks, dude. I hope you have a good work day. If you're on call. All right, let's take this back to Ghazi and see 
I just have a bad feeling that something's gonna happen to this guy, and it's gonna be heartbreaking. Okay, so yeah, I have 125 health now. I think that's good value. Oh, what is this? Okay, I want to see what this is. Being chased, of course. He's up top. Good tag team. What? Is that it? Maybe uh, if that guy hadn't shown up that... Maybe if that zombie doesn't show up, he talks to me or something. Oh, nice. Okay. I'm still learning about some of the traps, like the spikes I get. I really haven't kicked anyone into them yet, but seeing the uh, the puddles and stuff makes me think. It was storytelling, but it got interrupted? Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. But I, brought, I brought that runner there. Deep breath, deep breath, deep breath. Keep going, go. Okay. Yeah, this hammer, I love this. String, beautiful, beautiful. That's what we needed. Let me craft up another Molotov so I always have one. Alcohol and string. Wonder where I could find that reliably. I got a runner right behind me again. Go. Is there a such thing as uh, having basically iframes when you're climbing stuff? Does it mean that they can't hit you? Because that would be absolutely clutch if so. <laughs> Oh, wow. <clears throat> You're always vulnerable. Okay. Put a blueprint upgrade to the hammer to make it even stronger. Do I even have any available that I can make? Leech. Want to make your enemies bleed out? Of course you do. Find out how by following these simple steps. I, so I only have a, I have something for a pipe. Long knife. Oh, maybe this would work. Just any melee weapon. Yes. Okay. That's a good call. That is a good call. Thank you. Yeah, look at this thing. Ooh. Yes? Here's your movie and your chocolates. Wait till mom see this. Oh, God, he wins again. Hooray for God, eh? Right. Hey, then I'll just let myself in through the roof. Uh. Okay, now I'm basically violating his privacy. I'm gonna f force him to accept my help. Hmm. Um, maybe I can drop down from above? Enter through the roof. There's like, see all of these sections here? They all seem to be connected. steal his box of stuff. Maybe I'll wait. I 
feel like this is a bit of an aggressive maneuver here. <laughs> I don't want to take anything from the guy. Hello, Gazi. Oh, Shh. no. Don't move <laughs> your thought. Mama's watching. Oh, no. Is Mama happy? Yeah, Mama's real happy. Gazi got her chocolates and a movie. Well, then I'm gonna take some medicine to help my friend. Well, okay. Mama stopped getting seizures when her head turned into a pumpkin. They're on the table. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Gazi. Gazi make everybody happy. I don't know whether to laugh or cry. <laughs> I feel horrible. Uh, I will. I will raid your house if you don't mind. What's this note? Note twenty-one. Oh no. My Journal by Gauzy. Entry 1. I'm keeping a journal because the man in the movie about the smart mouse had to keep a journal. His name is Allerginan? Is that supposed to be like Algernon? And the longer you keep the journal, the smarter you get. Right now my smart level is 8, so I'm smarter than just about most people, but this journal will make me even more smart. Guess it could be good to be even smarter. <laughs> Entry two. Today my new smart level is nine. So I'm really much smarter than just about everyone who ever lived. When I went to the pharmacy to get my mom's drugs, the drug man said I could not have any more because my mom is a pumpkin head now. <laughs> so I started yell singing in my super voice. Then he said, okay, okay, and gave me the drugs. He was not nearly smart enough to go against Gazi. <laughs> Entry 3. Today my new smart level is 10, so I probably can't go much higher. I am so smart now, I can barely talk to people because they're so dumb. Maybe becoming super smart was a mistake? A lot of the people I see on the street are so much dumber than me that they seem to not be saying words at all. Just noises. <laughs> if they don't see me, then they just stand around doing nothing. She's talking about zombies. When they do see me, they act stupid and get mad at me for being so much smarter than them. I used to think people were busy and really smart. Becoming 10 level smart has opened up my eyes about people and how dumb and lazy they really are. From now on, I'm going to keep away from them. I just make people angry with my super smart mind. They wish they were gauzy, but they can't be gauzy. Just me. <laughs> what a beaut. Who's this? Gazi, you got a you got a girlfriend maybe. And a and a cat. And the wait, the girlfriend's wearing cat like makeup. Questionable. Enjoy the film. You won't need this. For this. The way I can justify this is he's he's basically a, he's a little bit conceited now, you know, with the whole uh, everyone's dumb thing. So I feel like this is justified. The girl is the cat. Well, maybe. Oh, we're close. Gimme. Oh, premium throwing stars. What's the difference? What am I looking at here? 102 damage. That'll do nicely. Just a few broken legs. I'm sure it's fine. Let me check the rest of these buildings because pretty good chance I'm never going to be back here.
Doesn't look like there's a way in here. Here we go. It should say actual throwing stars compared to the ones that I make with string and metal blades. They actually, they, you know, even though they're, <laughs> I don't know, it seems like they're physically impossible to make, they do work pretty well. So I can't really argue. There's something ping in there? Oh, weird. Thought there was. Do you want to know where you can find the mother load of crafting supplies for med kits? No, that's okay. I appreciate you wanting to help, but I like I like just exploring, ch chilling, you know. But we'll find it. We'll find everything we need eventually. Well, why am I in here? Why why was that door locked? It's a crack den, I think. Just a shack with no doors. All right, let's go. Did anyone watch the new Dune here? I loved Dune. I wanted to read the book before, but I, I found it really hard to get into, but that's just because for me, it takes me probably a good... Whenever I'm reading a new book, It takes me a solid, like, two or three attempts to read the first chapter. <laughs> oh, this guy. Maybe we'll talk to us now. Oh, he sells stuff. My trap is still on, I see. Wait, what? Oh, I'm gonna die. Jeez. What do you got here? Um, so is orange the best? Or is purple the best? I feel like orange was better than this. Does he pay the same amount? Yeah, he does. So I could sell my stuff to anyone, I guess. That's cool. Take that. Um, I would actually consider buying some of this stuff. And maybe I actually, maybe that's what I should be spending my cash on is the, um, all of this stuff. Cause I have seemingly endless amounts of cash. Friend of mine was talking very highly of the audiobooks. Yeah. Audiobooks too. I, I it takes me a couple goes, but that's just the way my brain works. It's hard for me to, to, um, digest knowledge. <laughs> This, this, oh no, we're in trouble. Heal. Oh boy. We're in trouble. <laughs> I'm gonna have to fight this guy. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. It takes me a while to, to get to know like new character names and new worlds and that kind of stuff. And especially in a complex book like um, 
Splatoon, where names are a bit more unfamiliar, quite a bit more unique. That stuff can be really challenging. Let's try and secure this. I kind of want to save the throwing stars because they seem really good. Nice. Come get me. Oh, look at this. Look at this guy coming in. Okay, well, <laughs> might be throwing star time. That's probably better to save for humans, but... That did clear out quite a few. Unkillable. These throwing stars aren't even one-shotting, like the other ones were. I mean, it's cool for style points. I don't know if it's good for leaving me in a bad position. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, the first time we saw one of these guys, we destroyed him right away. <laughs> wow. Full stun, too. I keep thinking I can move back a little faster than I'm able. Oh, there we go. That's the jump. That's right. That's right. There we go. I like that I've just learned that we can repair kind of on the fly. a tank Wow 
I don't know how I killed the first one so quickly. That's something else. my collectibles at I don't see one here maybe we don't get one let me get rid of this stuff Oh, hello. 206 damage. I like. It's going to be slow, isn't it? <laughs> wow. All right. Is this thing repairable? No. No, it isn't. Oh, no. a good way in there, but... Nobody has a good way in there, turns out. You gonna open up for me, or... Juggernaut. Thanks. Juggernaut, you don't say. So this gives extra durability... All right, let's go all in on the on the expensive hammer that we bought. That loot wasn't even worth it. Uh, Soren, thanks for the super chat. Good to see you streaming again. Missed your stream yesterday. Anyway, I have one question: Are you looking forward to the new God of War? Um, I'm looking forward to any new anything. To be honest with you, <laughs> anything new? Yes, I'm into it right now, big time. Big leap. Oh, my airdrop got stolen? I didn't even notice. No. That's rough. Okay. Bartering. Crafting expertise. Get better at crafting. Create more items from the same materials. Yep. Yep. That's big. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I am wearing a game-appropriate hat today. with all the games tightly packed yeah we talked about this quite a bit yesterday i was just sharing what my plans were for uh 
how I'm gonna cover all those. It's gonna be it's gonna be tough. But I mean tough. It's playing video games, let's be honest. Okay. Uh we will buy this. Thank you. Military shovel for 3500 Not bad. I am going to start buying all of this stuff. Sell my valuables. Always first to get to the drops. Conducting liquid. Okay, let's check this out. All-purpose toxic striker. Adds toxic effect to your attacks. Okay. Oh, cool. Look, we have a clock. I didn't notice that before. Conducting liquid. There's no need to explain that some liquids conduct electricity, right? Put some water in a bottle, throw that bottle at an infected, attack with an electric weapon, results galvanizing. Yeah, that makes sense. We'll whip up another med kit here. Get a Molotov going. Firecrackers seem to be pretty handy all the time. So we need herbs and toxic lichen, which I don't think we've seen yet. I don't even think we've seen herbs. So maybe they're in a, an area that we haven't been. Alright, I've got your anti-seizure medicine. Thanks. Oh, how things go with Gazi? Well, he may be challenged, but he's very good at getting what he wants. Did you meet his mom? Yeah, she seemed happy. If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. Speaking of which, Brecken asked me to pass this on to you. With his thanks. Nice. Champion upgrade. Okay. Okay. Improves all of your weapon stats. Level 1. Select. Okay. What does this do? Seems like a no-brainer to me. Well, I'm all in on the hammer. We're all in. Now, uh, do we want to look for a gun for this guy? I feel like... We have these things. Okay, so voltage we just learned about. Gunslinger. I think we don't have an objective for this, hey? This is just kind of a, if we find it, we find it. Let's go meet with Reyes. <laughs> I just like to do laps in the hallway before we leave, just to really get the heart going. Brecken is so desperate he's ready to deal with the devil himself, Rice. And since I'm supposed to determine whether or not Rice is the one who stole the GRE's secret document, well, this is the perfect opportunity. Oh, you know who I want to see before we leave is, um, the Quartermaster. You got a regular seat, you are. Oh, cool. Okay, that's actually... That's worth doing, in my opinion. Plus, we can take all of this stuff. Um... I guess he probably doesn't realize that I that he could just come over here and sell this stuff, right? I think that's what I'm gonna do. Exquisite short knife, orange grade. All right, so we get about ten percent of the value, I guess. Fine. Flammable liquid blueprint. Yeah, give me all of this, please. I've got a special deal for you.
Okay. So now we're starting to see some stuff that we can combo with those different damage types. I like that. I do like that. You guys want to try one of these trials? I'd be curious to see if I can pull one off. Okay, Parkour Fever. It's a set of new challenges that will put your free-running skills to the test. These challenges are based on leaderboards so you can compete with your friends and other players. <laughs> friends. In Parkour Fever, challenges each successful parkour action, jumping over obstacles, climbing on top of actions, sliding, grind to a small speed boost. You can stack up to 10, greatly increasing your running speed. Okay. Grappling hook is not allowed? What the hell? Grappling hook? I guess the sliding is good. was close. Cruising. Oh no! These races are long. It's really slow. That's really slow. Oh, sick. Oh, no. Made a big mistake. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, uh, we took a little bit of a fall there and uh, snapped our body in half. I don't know if I was even close to being able to complete it. Should we do it one more time? Let's do it one more time. We'll do it one more time. We'll see if I we'll see if I can come close. We were doing really good at the start there, a couple of slow spots. Actually, it's really intense. Okay, so I'm. Oh, did I lose my thing? Oh, I lost my combo there. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. We got stuck on this thing before. That was much better. I don't know how forgiving these are. What?
Yo, this is not as good as my last one. Oh. Ladders are not the way. Real cool. Oh, I'm not even close. I wonder if there's um I wonder if there's a an agility upgrade whereby your your climbing and your climbing and stuff is a lot faster cuz it's really slow to climb. Maybe that's something we can Come back to later. It's fun though. Does the big rebar matter for speed? Um, I don't know actually. That's a good question. But it's okay. We'll we'll come back later once we get some other stuff unlocked. Look at him now. You want to make sure he's I'm not gonna mess with those guys. Uh, let me repair this. Well, hold on. Where are we at? 10 out of 49. And we can just repair when it breaks, I think. Karahim, I'm here. Make sure they see you and know who you are. You don't want to sneak up on them. That's a good way to catch a bullet. Okay. Wish me luck, kid. Good luck, brother. You're going to need it. Don't sneak up on them? I'm here. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Hands up! What the fuck do you want? I'm here to see Rice. Brecken sent me. Brecken? That asshole on the tower? All right. What does he want? I've come to make a deal. What kind of deal? The kind I make with Rice, not with his flunkies. All right. Let him through. This ought to be entertaining. Hmm. I thought showing attitude would maybe be something we don't want to do there, but... Maybe it builds our credibility. How long have we been friends, Osman? We have been friends for a very long time. That is why I'm so surprised that you would steal from me. Haven't I seen you somewhere before? Now I give you a choice. Very simple. Your right hand or your left. <laughs> Oh! Hmm. Was that my left or your left? You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? Oh, look at all these drops they've been a procuring. A deal. For fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. And what do you offer in return? You guys look like brothers. Hmm? 
Your services, your loyalty. Perhaps I should take both. Talk to Karim. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some antizim. Understood? Okay. Help Kareem. I don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. We'll take this. Look at all the guns. You guys selling? Good chat, good chat. <clears throat> I met Rice, up, and Carl? Jade's right, he's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. trash if you guys had to chop off an or or a, a hand or a foot what do you pick because on one hand <laughs> you hear the jaw <laughs> shit you win in the last minute on one side your hands are like at least in my life pretty crucial but if one foot you're not moving much i don't know man that's a, that's tough actually you want the brecken's little pups aren't you okay what are you selling You and I could be real good friends. There you are. Rice said you'd be coming by. I'm Karim. Crane. An American. Non-dominant hand, uncle clearly. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. <laughs> if I do this, I'll get the answers in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well. Yeah. This is one of those scenarios where you're like... You're doing it because now you, ha you have to do it. But there's no way the guy is just like, okay, here you go. It's just a never-ending deal with the devil, pretty much. Wait until night? Where are we at here? I mean, it is night. The thing is, one-handed, you can't really play games. He's like Rice's games. major domo, I guess. Or number one flunky, at the very least. Kareem's sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy. Do what we gotta do. You can't game. You, you, okay, that's not true. You can game, but you're gonna have to learn a whole new way of gaming. Which would be so frustrating. Oh, I... Oh. The frustration alone would kill me. I don't know, but then... Yeah, the foot? I don't think I could lose a foot either. I don't know, man. I would I would just... Whoever was holding the gun to my... Or my the, the axe to my limbs... I would uh, tell them to make the choice. Because I don't think I could. Go the drill, guys. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. This is the last warning before dark. Um. I'm 
feeling like I'm gonna have to rest here. You've played one-handed before and it sucks. Yeah, I mean. Crane. <laughs> I guess there are some games just you could just lies. you could just There's play no with question. the mouse. That's Suleiman. Guy's a psychopath. He's gone from ruthless politician to fucking warlord. Is he aware of your affiliation with us? No. He thinks I'm just a guy from the tower. In fact, he's making me jump through hoops before he'll give me any antizen. Acknowledged. Continue to do as he asks. Remember, we need that file. Great. I need to Great find up. out who this voice is. Like who like who is she? Will we ever meet her, is the question. Okay, I'm gonna go see if we can rest until daytime here. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. Or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem's sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. I'd rather lose being a foot. An My boy. hands are too important. I basically live for sewing and other creative hobbies. Oh, that's cool. What kind of stuff do you sew, guinea pig? I actually, uh, when I was younger, I took up sewing a little bit because uh, my grandmother was into it. Okay, this says wait until night. Wait until morning. Oh, okay, I see, okay. Night wasn't quite there yet. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. I have seen people like, um, with disabilities that can play games with their mouth. Um, there's a, there's actually a lot of, a lot of companies are making, trying to make games much more accessible now for more people to enjoy. And I think that's been really cool to see these companies really get into that. It's not that you couldn't learn, it's just it would be, would be hard and frustrating as all hell. Over the past, like, eight months or so, I've really gotten into and kind of... <laughs> sounds cliche, but... Oh, what is this? Fluorescent shrooms right in front of me? Wait, what is that? Oh, maybe I only... See, maybe you can only see them at night or something? Is that possible? Oh, they're across the thing. Can I track this? Oh, neat. Oh, right here. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. Okay, see ya. Over the last, like, eight months or so, I've really fallen in love with running. Always wanted to be a runner. What exactly am I doing? That's a benefit for everyone, not just Rise. Perhaps, but the Emperor must monitor his empire. And that's the only... Frick. That's the only reason that I would consider not cutting off... Or cutting off a hand instead of a, a foot. Is because that's literally changed my entire... Well, I think it's literally changed my life. <laughs> not to be overly dramatic, but... Honest to God, I think it's changed my life. And, um, if I lost that, I don't know how I would deal with it. It's been so good for, like, my physical health, but also my mental health has been hugely improved by it. Okay, so now, this is the first time I'm seeing that we have this kind of stuff on the map. I gotta be checking that quite a bit more. What does that little downwards arrow mean? These are two huge boys. 
They seem to love the electricity. Oh, is it a... Uh... I guess that's good for me. Something under here. Lock picking hard. Okay, okay, I have a plan. Did these guys respect the zappers? Oh boy. Frick. Come on. I gotta get out of here. Force is like right in the middle. You're kidding me, dude. Wow. Oh, is he on me? I think he might be on me. I gotta run. Hello. Taylor, thanks again, man. The lady you keep talking to on the walkie-talkie has to be Amanda Waller? Who is Amanda Waller? Kareem, I'm at the first antenna. Okay, we can clear these. Yeah, okay. The power's not on. You'll have to turn it on. There'll be a switch in the small building at the antenna's base. All right. We may as well grab whatever we see here. Then we can do the antenna. I should probably get as many safe houses as possible. Even though it might be challenging. Does this game have any mods? Because I would love a mod where it's like... <laughs> auto disassemble any greys. Or, or even like a batch disassemble would be nice. Whoa! Oh, that's new. What the... F Because this fucked up infected motherfucker was coming <laughs> out of his mouth, just spit a bunch of toxic snot at me. <laughs> fucked up infected motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. Okay. How am I gonna kill that? With fire? <sighs> and I'm melting, but so is he. Oh, I'm getting swarmed. I took down the big boy, though. That'll work. Get in there. Everyone assemble. Looking for more potential traps.
Jeez. That mostly worked, actually. He may have killed her. Grab another one of these. Okay, so maybe with these heavy rebars... Maybe I just don't hold back. I use them until they're gone. Since we can't upgrade them anyways. And they seem to be one-shots. And then when I find a new guy, I just grab a new rebar. It's just too bad that I can't really sustain much swinging. I love that we have just neatly packed little body bags. Use the lost lures? I would. Whoa. What do we have here? Battle journal. Number six. This is the first time we've seen one out of order, I think. We have zero, one, two, and now six. Oh my god, you won't believe what I saw today. These hazmat looking weirdos with big ass gas tanks. We learned about that earlier. Strapped to their backs. Check it out. When you damage the tank, it'll start spraying everywhere. It can even lift the guy wearing it off the ground and then the tank explodes. Why? I have no idea. I mean, seriously, what's in the tank? It doesn't matter. What matters is it'll clear whole areas fast if you do it right. Okay, yeah, that's cool. I like that. I like that. Wow. Cosmetics? Okay. What? There we go. There. The power's fucking on. <laughs> Power's fucking on. These buildings all closed. I want to see if when we clear it, if it removes the, the map icon, like showing that we got them all kind of thing. Or maybe they regrow, too. That's possible. But back here, th where those mushrooms were... Oh no, maybe that was here. Yeah, maybe they regrow. 
Oh, look at this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're actually climbing that. Sick. Hey, Andrew. You guys want to see how this works? Um, that was worth trying for that. Pulls up pretty quick. Hey, Anka. Nice to see you, dude. That's a custom marker. No, no, I know that. I was talking about this. <laughs> These markers. Like the the actual item. Not not my custom marker. Uh Oh, I see. They block certain sections. That ain't it. Oh! Wetty. Okay, so far so good. One wrong step, we're definitely dead. So that's not great. How the hell? Someone already scavenged this thing for parts. There's nothing up here to switch on. Fuck, I was afraid of that. All right, head to the next antenna tower. It's not too far from there. Just use the zip line and head east. You'll see it. He probably knew. Okay, you get better at fighting, gain more stamina, receive access to a new set of combat abilities. Yes, please. I have a drop there, and it's stolen. All right. Let's see about getting these, um, getting the safe houses on our way. Probably shouldn't have done that, eh? Definitely shouldn't have done that.
Jeez. Yeah, I'll take that right away. Whatever that is. Get better at free running. L run longer, climb more quickly, gain agility faster. Oh, I mean, this would have been great for the uh, for the time trial. There's so many. Okay, what do I have here? Throwing stars, crackers. Can I? I can Molotov. Let's do this. Everybody gather round. Supper time. Maybe closing that uh, earlier is better. Because clearing the area becomes a little bit quicker. Is this... The second safe house in a row with no, uh, with no statue? I don't like that. I was told there would be statues. I think I'm gonna let that guy survive. Not every base has statues. Hey, Kareem, what do I do if the second transmitter's trashed? The better question is, what will you do if you disappoint Rice? And the answer is probably, die horribly. <laughs> I appreciate the honesty. <laughs> They're on me. <laughs> I need an opening. It's all barbed wire. I need an opening. the gurgly death sounds. Is it weird that I like that? Okay, let's do another safe house here and then we'll go to the antenna. The sooner this will end. I don't know. I swear to God. What the... Hope I didn't burn the other guys. Oh, 
Oh, this guy's actually pretty tanky. Good for him. Where are you going? I love that they just like ping ping like the freaking true ninjas. Come on, motherfucker. Yeah, you fucked up. Yeah, these guys are good fighters, though. God damn it. Now you're just making me mad. Damn it. I feel like that puts me in harm's way more than it helps me. Yeah, I'm coming, dude. Jeez. Simmer the frick down. Thank God you came along. Otherwise, those animals would have killed us. I can't imagine what those bastards would have done to us. I'm just grateful I'm still alive. I'll take that cash. Thank you. This game does a really good job of, like, giving you just tons of stuff to do. Like, almost too much. Well, I got more coming in here. If this one doesn't have a statue, I swear to God. Weren't there like a thousand of them to collect anyway? I think I have th <laughs> three. I don't like this. <laughs> Nothing. It's a scam. It's a scam! Zero Tool, what's up, man? Thanks for the six months, dude. Can't wait for Dying Light 2. Yeah, you're excited, eh? That's cool. I am also looking forward to it. I got to play about three and a half hours of it. Three and a half, four hours. And, uh... It's cool. They've made a couple changes. I don't... I'm not sure how much I can talk about, but yeah, I'm looking I'm looking forward to it. That I can at least say. This is how I die. Okay, let's do a couple of these bad boys. I need Toxic Lichen. You like RPG games? Because I love you. Ali, I love you too. I like RPG games, yeah. Of course. Hey, Santiago. Just came, I was sleeping, just woke up. 
Good morning. Or good night, or whatever. Greener at the second antenna tower. The fence is electrified. I think someone's inside. That will be Alexei. Probably his son, Christoph. Well, you want to tell him to power down the fences? or? let them stand in your way. You've got to get inside and turn on the transmitter. Oh. No, this isn't going to help. Are there any openings? Maybe I can go through that on top of this building here and I can jump over maybe. <laughs> I don't know about this. Maybe that rock face here? Yeah, that looks better. <laughs> what the fuck do you want? I'm coming in. I need to climb the tower. Why the hell would you want to do that? For Rise. He asked me to. Rice? <laughs> you don't look like one of his crew. Oh, fine. I'll just radio back and tell Rise that you wouldn't let me through. What? Fuck. No, 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 I didn't say that. You want to climb? Fine. Go, go. No backbone. No backbone. Do anymore. Will you keep your voice down? I don't care who hears me. Kristoff, what's wrong with you? We're trying to stay alive here. Is a that death wish. These guys are killers. Yes. Can I murders. climb that? So we work for them. That's how it stays safe. I don't think so. It's all blocked up. Oh, what? I can't break this. waiting for there's going to be a missing panel in the floor and oh god and I'm going to nail it I sure hope this Whoa, fucking climb was worth up? it I don't know if I like that okay what am I doing now that's climbable Let's go. You pull it back so hard you fly off the tower. And this thing's still intact. Let's see if it was worth the hassle. Hey, Kareem. Second transmitter's up and running. Is it working? Kareem, do you hear me? Loud and clear. Nice job. You know the way back, right? Right. Yeah. Go the opposite way we came. Got new outfits. Oh my god, everything's coming together. It's a thing of beauty. Okay. These are all locked. Six slots for carrying. Yes, please. Runner outfit. Hey, Thomas. What's up, man? Late Zoom meeting. Happy to get back to Dying Light. Yeah, thanks, man. Thanks for joining. Good to see ya. Oh, they bust out of there with such gusto. It was you, wasn't it? Raheem? The antenna. Bracken told me. Communication is crystal clear now. Good job. This helps everybody, but especially Dr. Zera and Dr. Camden. They can hit each other. Oh, I think I hit it. For the first time since... Whatever. Oh, no. 
Nope. See you back in the tower. I tried to hit the... I tried to hit the canister, and then I would have just failed, but... I kind of wish that you would get the... the multiplier. Outside of the uh, time trials. You should be. No, let me go. I just right back in trouble. Oh, you're on your own now, buddy. You're on your own. Whoa, you can swim? What? Since when? What the hell? I didn't know we could swim. Oh, I bet you this thing is totally uh, busted now. I'm gonna have to ditch it. feel really a false sense of security with this weapon that absolutely crushes but it's so slow in one whiff and you're screwed Okay, what do we got going on here? Get rid of that. Got the whole screen now for storage. So much room for activities. Hey, there we go. Well, that's... annoying. See the movie Spider-Man No Way Home? Uh, no, I haven't, actually. I haven't. Let's see this runner outfit. Sure. My clothes are dirty anyway. Uh, I've got a couple zips here. Sector Zero is completely sealed 
sealed off. Mr. Crane, until you restored radio communication, we didn't know if anyone else in the city was alive. I just wanted to let you know how grateful we are. You've given us a small measure of hope. Uh, well, They're gonna need me to do stuff for them now, aren't they? If there's ever any way we can help you, Mr. Crane, please, don't hesitate to ask. Wow. What's up, Ozzy? How you doing, man? <clears throat> I'm doing well. Job's done. Now it's time to get back to Rice and get that Antis in. I, I like Holland the best, too, of all the Spider-Men. I like him. Uh, Toby is, is probably my second, but... Toby's kind... Toby kind of gives me, like, asshole vibes. You know? I like Andrew Garfield, but I don't think he's a great Spider-Man. Well, but you not only Tom Holland did the job crushes it. You, but you made it back in one piece. Bravo. Can I get some answers? And he's so now? easily liked, you, think you know. Would be satisfied so easily. You still have plenty to prove. Look, we really need the drugs. Let me have them now, and then I'll come back and do whatever. You'll get Antazine when I say you get it, not one second before. But as I have established, I am not unreasonable. Do all that I ask of you, and I will give you not one but two. Crates of Antazine. <sighs> All right, fine. What do you want me to do? This will be different from your exploits on the antennas. It will require a bit more persuasion. The imposing of one's will, the creation of one's own rules, that is what makes a man. Do you live by your own rules, Crane? Or are you merely someone else's puppet? Right now, Feels I like your hand so far answer. in my butt that I am your puppet. Talk to Karim before I decide you are no longer worth the trouble. This guy also gives me asshole vibes. <laughs> Favorite Batman Cinnabons? That's easy. <laughs> A carload, as usual. So easy. George Clooney. Obviously. Just kidding. <laughs> it's Michael Keaton. That's the right answer. No, there, there's no other, there's no other answer. You could make a good argument for Christian Bale, okay? You could make a great argument for Christian Bale. But it's Michael Keaton. I'm sorry, but that's fact. Uh, okay, let's buy these. That's our new strategy. We're no longer... We're no longer uh, buying weapons there. We're just buying extra stuff. No, yeah, Michael Keaton is 100% the correct answer. No, yeah, there's no argument there. But if you had to say besides Michael Keaton, Christian Bale. Christian Bale, definitely. Christian Bale did a realistic job. Yeah. Yeah, I liked his, um, his, tr like, that trilogy was really good. But, even it, I actually don't know how it stands up today, but I have such fond memories of the original Batman and, uh, the Penguin, Danny DeVito as the Penguin. Haunts me, almost. Haunts me. Adam West, Keaton Clooney. Adam West is a little bit more old school for me. I, I never really watched Adam West as it. As Batman. So, yeah. I, I, I couldn't pick Adam West because I don't have the knowledge, you know? I think Robert Pattinson is going to do... I think it's going to go over really well. I didn't see the the Batman with Affleck. Ben Affleck, right? He was Batman. I didn't see him. He's got the right like uh, physique. I feel for Batman, whereas Robert Pattinson feels a little bit too slender almost. But I I feel like he's gonna kill it. I feel like he's gonna kill it. And I think I actually think Robert Pattinson he's gonna be like he's gonna be one of the big movie stars of the current generation. He's going to be big. He's going to be like Clint Eastwood big, you know? 
I haven't seen Adam West use his anti-shark spray. No, I haven't. I don't even, I don't, is that a thing? Is that a meme? I don't even know. I don't even know. Pete Holmes? Who's Pete Holmes? Am I excited to play Dying Light 2? <laughs> no. Ah, my friend. Rice likes you, I can tell. Yeah, how? Because you are still among the living. The task at hand is as easy as can be. You simply have to make a few pickups from some nearby settlements. Which ones? The first is Jafar's wheel station. It's God, just they just have us doing all the bear in mind bitch quests, everyone hey? Everyone you talk to today Ugh. will be in a cooperative state of mind. I'm sure you can be convincing, though, no? Yeah, I can be convincing. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Let's go contact our <laughs> sketchy group. I can't say I'm what are you guys talking about bat nipples? What am I not getting? <laughs> but the GRE won't let me just walk away. Plus, if there's any chance that we can get that antis in, I have to try. But this time he wants me to gather protection money from the surrounding settlements. And after this, he better hand over the drugs. I called this. I knew there was... Not, it's never just one thing. It's like... The most cliched... Bad guy ever. I'd love to be surprised. Look at me, we're flying right now. Well, you know what? I'm gonna try and get high ground here. Come on. No, okay, cool, excellent, good, yeah. Call it in. <laughs> Yo, Amantar, thanks for the nine months, man. Just stay who you are. You're Came the best. Here. That's super Report. kind. Thanks, dude. Another job for Rice. This one's pretty dirty. He's forcing me to collect the money he's extorting from a nearby village. Just do what he asks and stay close to him. Remember what's at stake. Yeah, crane out. Robert Pattinson's definitely an underrated actor. People need to watch him in anything that's not Twilight. Yeah. Um, there's one movie. So he was really good in Tenet. <clears throat> there's another movie that's been on my list for a long time. I think it's called The Lighthouse. And apparently he's really good in The Lighthouse. Um, it's him and one other guy. I can picture his face, but I can't pick... I can't... His name is on the tip of my tongue, but I can't remember what it is but it's basically him and one other actor and i think it might even be black and white you guys know what i'm talking about what about the best joker oh yeah willem willem dafoe yes thank you yes yes that's the one exactly willem dafoe yeah <clears throat> The back of police vehicles have weapons and sometimes guns and bat nipples. <laughs> Are you serious? I'll, I'll look. What about the be the best Joker is, I mean, come on. I mean, come on. It's not even a, it's not even a challenge. It's Jim Carrey. It's Jim Carrey. I'm just kidding. <laughs> It's Heath, man. It's Heath. Um, it, wasn't Jared Leto uh, a Joker as well? He was pretty good. I think he was a Joker, wasn't he? Maybe he was a Riddler. I can't remember. I, actually, I think Jim Carrey might have been Riddler as well. Um, Jack Nicholson from the first one. Pretty good. But Kareem, Heath Ledger. Uh, Talk to you long enough. Get Unreal. the job done and make it fast. This is just the first stop. Mark Hamill? Yeah, Jim Carrey was Riddler. Okay. Mark Hamill, Joker? Really?
Oh, was he uh, animated? The animated Joker? That doesn't count, guys. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. Hey, I'm running a special right now. Bro, could you be sketchier? Here, I'm gonna sell this to him. I just found it right behind him. Here. He's gonna pay me ten dollars for this thing that was sitting right behind him. Take it. Thanks. I actually don't have anything to sell him. Ooh, look at the police baton. Holy crap. That's a that's big boy money right there. It doesn't count, you guys. You you can't count animated, okay? You could you could you could say cuz that's I get it. I, trust me. Voice acting, I love it. I'm all for it. But it's not comparable. Welder. Adds fire. All right, so what am I currently rocking right now? I got max upgrades on the brick hammer. All right. I don't really have another thing that I'm... I mean, I'm invested in the in the water pipe. I guess I can repair this. Oh, it has no repairs. So now, should I sell this? I would, I'm curious to see what the value would be. Or if I dismantle, I just get one part. So I could probably sell that. Um, This I could repair. Thirty-one, forty-two, thirty-two, fifty-nine. Yeah, okay. Let's do this. Um, let's do that. So, oh, this has to be a wrench or a hammer. I could give it bleeding, I guess. You're gonna give me 31 bucks. Feels good. <laughs> Jack, yeah, Jack Nicholson's a really good one, Masky. Definitely. Yeah, I can't fault you for if you're picking Jack. Dinesh! With the super chat and no Mine message. In Iran. Dang. Mine is by far the least shitty. <laughs> Michael uh, is asking, do I sell off my Indian motorcycle? <laughs> yes, I do. I uh, bought a, an Indian Challenger last summer, and um, <laughs> it's a phenomenal bike. It's a phenomenal bike. Actually, uh, Michael, if you're not following me on Instagram, I suggest that you do that. Because I'm going to be making an announcement there on Friday that's Indian motorcycle related. You Jafar? Oh, I understand all. My name isn't important. What's important is that Rai sent me and that you owe him some money. I've never seen you before. For all I know, you're just some random asshole. Fuck off. I'll tell you what. How about I break both your legs and drag you through the streets back to Rice's place, huh? And then he can explain to you that you should have cooperated. Persuasive. Okay, okay. Persuasive. Jesus. You are one of Rice's thugs. You guys are the only ones who'd act this shitty. Here, here's your money. Take it. And if I have to come back here... You won't get any more attitude. Mi casa, su casa. Just don't hurt me, all right? <laughs> all right. Persuaded. I kind of wish that there were conversation options. Yeah, because I feel like there's there's opportunities in this game where that could be good. That could be neat, but no. We don't get to do that. Kareem, it's me. So I just threatened to break an old man's legs. And it worked, didn't it? Next, you collect a tribute from the fisherman's village. Head east, to the tunnel entrance. Their messenger always meets us there. 
Carl, you think you can guess what it is? Are you talking about the what I said about Instagram? Maybe. Maybe, maybe not. My uh, my buddy and I, this is not the the announcement, but um, my buddy and I are starting a YouTube channel this, I guess, spring. And uh, we're going to start a, uh, a motorcycle-focused channel. Something we've wanted to do for a while, and we're going to finally right. pull the trigger and do right? it. Oh, Brecken's calling. I'm, I'm running errands for Rise. He wields a lot of power. He scares a lot of people. Damn right he does. Listen, mate, time's getting short. We're almost out of answers in. As much as I hate to admit it, I'm getting worried. I'm doing the best I can out here, Brecken. I know, I know. I understand. I just want you to be aware of the stakes. I'm infected too, remember? Believe me, I'm motivated. Oh <laughs> all right, all right. Here's hoping you can make it back to the tower soon. I was kind of wondering if they were going to check in on me, because we just disappeared. <clears throat> so yeah, anyways, we're going to start, we're starting a, a motorcycle-focused channel this spring to kind of just, mostly for fun, but if it turns into something, cool. We're both, like, super passionate about it, and um, I think it'll be a good time. I'll probably do, I'll probably put one video up on my channel saying, hey. You. I'll probably put up one video when we start it, saying, hey, if you guys are interested in this kind of thing, I'm starting this second channel and stuff, but I'm not going to, besides that, basically one mention, I'm not going to go ham with, like, spamming people to check it out, because I really only want them to do it. I really only want people to be there if it's something that they're going to watch consistently. But I will t I will let you guys know when that's going down. So if you're into that kind of stuff, then that'll be cool. Yes, we must be inside. Seems a little bit sketchy, if you ask me. <laughs> Oh, nice. He's got a little hidey hole. Odd gear with the sidecar. How many of you guys ride? I know some of you guys are, are definitely uh, pretty proficient riders, but... Will it be about maintenance or be like riding around and adventuring? Oh, the latter. It will not be about maintenance. Um, yeah, it will not be about maintenance. But, you know what? It's going to be mostly about uh, traveling, the trips that we do, just kind of whatever. It'll be some ride-along stuff. I think it's going to be really fun. We'll maybe get into doing uh, reviews of certain things. Maybe bikes, maybe gear, whatever. We're going to kind of... We're going to kind of figure it out as we go, but we have a basic outline. Ooh, Titan. I don't think we've seen that before, guys. This is exciting. All right. Titan. Durability. I mean, it's plus... Yeah. Titan sounds so cool. It's like, oh, plus three. I guess I won't complain. Can you remove upgrades? I never actually thought to check for that until right this second. Seven bucks and that whole duffel. Does riding a bicycle count? <laughs> yeah, sure. I don't... Yeah. Am I going to play the DLC? Hmm, I don't know. Probably not. 2001 Ducati Monster. Oh, you're a Ducati guy? 
That's cool. Do I watch Fortnite in Canada? Oh, Fortnite. Yeah, yeah. He he does he does really good stuff. That's that's more like um he does more uh teaching, product reviews, stuff like that. This, ours is going to be quite a bit different from that. Ooh, okay. Oh, that door must have been locked then. I didn't even check it. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it. Jeez. It's so... These hard ones are legit hard. Especially for somebody who doesn't have any patience. Well, that's probably not bad. 33. I guess I should probably use this until it's gone. Because we modified it, but... Does riding a scooter count? Yeah, I mean, it's got wheels. I think that's... I think that's fair. How much do Ducatis usually go for? Ducatis are at the higher... Uh... Higher end of the price range. Generally. Oh. Maybe the other door is... Not locked. The tower here. Jade speaking. It's gonna get dark soon. If you think you're not gonna make it back to the tower... Find the closest safe house. I have a safe house very close. Okay, so both doors are locked? Oh, damn! He's got teeth in his chest! What the frick? Whoa, did he just give birth to that pipe? Hey, Kareem, I just saw something I've never seen before. This huge <laughs> bloated infect that just fucking exploded. Whoa. Yeah. I like that plan, yeah. Are you kidding me? Keep your distance and you'll this be is to right. that back section now. Was he there? No, I didn't. I didn't see anybody. Just fucking zombies. All right, you'll have to go to the village directly, I suppose. Bro, come on. A man named Gersel. Very hard. I think I don't think I've seen a very hard lock yet. Oh, it's like right in the middle here. Yeah, close. <laughs> okay, I gotta just be a little bit more sensitive. People in chat have been spamming like about ambulances and police vehicles. So I see one, I finally get one. Now I got a, now I got a gun. Now I got a gun. Now that I could give to our dude there, uh, Diwali or whatever his name is. Dawood. Pretty close. Could do that. But like, why am I not wanting to use a gun? Look how, look at the value. Okay, this thing's almost dead. I'm just going to ditch this food bar now. Okay, so why, why would I not want to use a gun? Probably because it's loud AF. Unka, what kind of bike do you ride? Those were his ribs? Oh, I thought they were teeth. Oh, God. Oh, he blows up immediately. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, now I get it. There's no, there's no, uh...
No, no, no! I'm in trouble. This is just how you fight the lost in XCOM, too. You just get on top of stuff. Hope for the best. No, I'm probably not making a, a conscious enough effort to actually hit them in the head. Last one was a Boulevard two years back. It was my third. Oh, cool, man. That's uh, Suzuki, right? I think I rode a Suzuki Boulevard in uh, in training, if I'm not mistaken. Which I might be, but. Okay, I definitely haven't been checking vehicles enough, that's for sure. But now, I have a new lease on life, and I will be checking vehicles. Oh, hell yeah. There's alcohol in here. Of course. Oh my god, the vehicles all have a bunch of stuff! I better get going. <laughs> okay, this is big. Okay, I need to figure out my plan here. What am I doing? Um, I need to go here. But how do I get there? I need to go back through here. First was a full fairing Honda Silverwing. Oh, nice. I've never seen a Silverwing. Um, I've seen the... the Quite a few gold wings. Maybe I've seen a silver wing without realizing it, though. Like, that's possible. Shit. This is our first safe house, guys. We're back. Wait, who's calling me? Wait, what is this guy doing? And what's beeping? How are you just chilling here? Sell valuables? See ya. Alright. Cool, I guess. Night is coming. Oh, maybe that's what the beeping is for? God, it is... It is tempting to, like... Go out and do a couple of things to... Well, that's... Oh, that was you. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, not on edge. Hey, Odd, if you don't do the DLC the following, that's really cool. It's a pretty vital part of the story for Crane and the overall universe. Okay, well, let's see. Let me worry about... Let me see... Let's worry about the main game first. And then we'll go from there. I don't know if you guys are picking up on it, but I'm definitely getting uh, some performance hits in the game. From time to time. But I have everything at, at max, so. That could be why. I could probably drop my view distance a little bit. Motion blur off. Alright. Anyways. Time for sleep. Go for a night run, get a feel for it. He did a night run yesterday. That was, that was nasty, dude. Super nasty. I got absolutely wrecked. Okay, meet the second pickup at the Fisherman's Village. Okay, I'm going back, back through the tunnel. Let's go. Annoying. Uh, what did Unka say? Didn't have AC or a stereo. It was 1986. What do you What do you mean? Didn't have AC? The motorcycle. <laughs> Is that a joke? 
that I'm not getting? Probably. Oh, that's a... Oh, so they also just blow up if I run past them. Oh, that might be abusable. What do you guys think are some of the best weapons in the game? I'm liking the, uh, I'm liking the police baton. Just for, like, the wackity whack that I can get away with. It's so fast. Did he just counter me? Oh my god. He may have. I'm gonna clear this safe house. Machetes, hatchets. Wait until you get a nice kopesh. Oh, that's cool. You guys are all into a bunch of different stuff, so... That means that there isn't just one best thing. The foot is the only weapon you need. <laughs> that's pretty good. Oh, God, it's a tower? My safe house? Oh, frick. Well, I asked for it. Okay, what am I carrying right now? Used by survivors to keep night infected at bay. I still haven't used that. Do I have any fire weapons? No. I'm just going to put this over here because I'm not using it right now. Um, I do have bleeding weapons, but that's not really helping me. Oh, what's this? Proves handling level 2 of a melee weapon. Okay, that already has my upgrade. Uh, I think I'll just hold it, I guess. Okay, I do need to make something to fight these guys with, though. Are Molotovs still only making me one? Oh, I'm getting two now. That's good. I do like that. And we'll try some freezing stars. In there, you big idiot. <laughs> Thanks. One shot. Well, sort of. Damn it. That was pretty lucky. Okay, these guys are actually working me right now. Okay, those things I crafted. Yeah, there we go. Let's see how this works. Oh. Oh, that's really good. I wonder if they have a shatter.
Like, if I combo that freeze with something else, if I can just, like, blow them up. Very happy you're enjoying riding. It's like skydiving once you start. You can't stop. Honestly, it's, yeah, it's been really good for me, too. Um, I talked about kind of, like, my mental health earlier with running, but... Riding contributes to that big time. So I have a really uh, active brain, I guess. Like it's noisy. And when I when I'm riding, it's uh, I can I can focus on just one thing at a time, pretty much because I have to or else I'll die. <laughs> so it's really. Uh, really easy to get focused when you're riding. Okay, how am I getting that? Oh, hello. I, I'm not gonna lie, I actually hate collectibles in games. Like, I hate it. I think it's so shitty. <laughs> it's just lazy. It does nothing for me to find collectibles, trophies and stuff. If it's like uh, notes and stuff, like if the if the collectible was finding a hundred notes that added to the story like we've seen, that's cool. But just finding statues drives me crazy. What are these little things that are attached on the side here? Oh, they're like, uh... Oh, there's cabling attached? No, I don't know what those would be. Bobbleheads and follow... Yeah, like any of that stuff. Any of that stuff. This doesn't do anything for me. The thing is, when I'm playing and they're right in front of me, like, I'll do them. Like, whatever. Or in this, right? If they're supposed to be at safe houses, yeah, I'll look. But otherwise, uh, doesn't doesn't excite me. Is this a thing I can take? I really hope so. Oof. Wait, there's something at the very top. Is there something at the very top? I'll climb it again. <laughs> Yeah, so this little thing I'm standing on, what is what purpose does this serve in a tower like this? Come on, guys. You're all radio tower experts. I'm sure you know. Chat always knows. Okay, so there's more? Chat, come on, we we literally just talked about this. <laughs> we just talked about it. This makes me queasy. 
This makes me queasy. How do I, uh... Oh, here. Nice. We'll just wrap some bandages on there. We'll be fine. <laughs> One health. Didn't want to tell you it was just a flag. Yeah, thanks. Thanks. Appreciate that. That was... I did that. I did not feel confident doing that drop. No. I could have rode that whole thing, man. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Hold up. Let's clear my map here. Is this that broken bridge that we saw at the beginning? Probably, eh? How am I going to get across here? Am I swimming? Make the second pickup at the fisherman's village. <laughs> Gotta be down here, right? Yeah, I think so. Do you ever get a vehicle or something we can just rip around it and run over a bunch of these guys at once? Fisherman's Village. Okay, Kareem, I'm outside the village, but there's a whole horde of infected in there. So, clear them out. We get paid for protection. Oh, no! Oh, God. As soon as I clicked the button. As soon as I clicked the button, I knew what was going to happen. As soon as I clicked it, I was doomed. Frick. Uh, love that. Love that. Love that. Mm -hmm. It's fine. I needed the practice. The expansion has buggies? So you're saying no vehicle then? What about like a chopper so I can just like launch missiles at these guys? That would be reasonable. Sounds like a jet's flying over me right now. Oh, there is a drop there. Holy hell. Should I go get that? It's pretty far. Oh no. Hey, you looking for a fight, fuckhead? Call me fuckhead? Stay away from me. Whoops. He's dead, he's really dead. So wait, was this the airdrop? So it's not always those... Those other things. I guess now that I'm here, nah, that's that's too far back. Forget it.
back to the village. Probably gonna have to go through here. Or maybe I won't. Oh boy. Shit. I'm gonna die here, definitely. smooth. Didn't panic at all. Hey! Toxic Lichen. Oh, maybe this is where, maybe it grows on the uh, cliff sides. Well, this was uh, welcomed. Finally. Airdrop. Wait, what? Okay, so I must have missed- I must not have gotten the right thing. I, that's why I was wondering, like, don't they drop the parachutes? I must have been- I probably right on it, too. <laughs> What's up, Andrew? Thanks for the nine months, brother. Can't wait for the Oddly fans? I mean... How do you know it's not already there? That's the question. Okay, yeah, airdrops are always an orange case. That's what I thought. Oh, I know. <laughs> Close the gate and clear the village of infected. Okay, yeah. Let me just not blow up that dude this time. Four more of those fuckers get inside. <sighs> Where's that big explodey bastard? I can't wait to play this game when I'm in a bad mood. I think I'm gonna, it's gonna be therapeutic. Search the huts for the leader. Oh boy. Hello, anyone here? Just stay still. Maybe you go away. I'm trying to kick the door in. Anyone here? Rice sent me, I'm here for a pickup. Cool, thanks. Yes? Who, who goes there? I'm here on Rice's behalf. I'm supposed to pick something up. Oh my god, that's one of Rice's men. What do I do? Just tell him to go away. I can hear them. Nice, and maybe he'll leave us alone. Better yet, send him to Gersel. He'll know what to do. Gersel? Please, we don't know anything. Go, talk to Gersel. He lives above the storm. Hey, anybody in there? Not so loud. The brother monsters. Look, I got rid of them, but you better reinforce that gate before more show up. You got rid of them? All of them? Rai sent me. 
You Gersel. Oh, you were for rise. Uh, Unfortunately. Too good to be true. You've taken enough. You can't have any more freaking tell him. Ayla, please. Just let me talk to the man. You can't just push us around like this. Furkin gonna kick your ass. Do it, Furkin. Kick his ass. For God's sake. Look, I don't want any trouble. But we already paid this month. You're gonna bleed us dry. That is entirely not my problem. Rise wants his payment. So you make the payment or things get bad for you. And your woman. You can't threaten us. Kick his ass, Furkin. Give me a break, I <laughs> I dare ya. All right, fine, here. This is all of it. Ugh. A real man? I like his little ship disaster. tattoo there. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Sounds like you have bigger problems than money. <laughs> okay. Okay, Kareem, I got Gersel's money. I fucking hate myself now, but I got the money. <laughs> the self-hatred fades eventually. Just one pick up to go. What's the this other little thing here? Pier. Hold on. There's a ferry. There was until the Navy sent it to the bottom of the bay. Dozens of people were stranded there. Oh, my staff. Waiting for another one that never came. Are there any boats left? Yes, but any boat that tries to leave the bay gets blown right out of the water. Okay, then. Any guess how those infected got through the fence? Guess. I know exactly how they got in. That masked nut job soared through the husp. Who are you talking about? They call him Gas Mask Man. He Birkin lives outside. Gersel. He's crazy in the head. So he wears a gas mask all the time. Like it's going to protect him. And you're sure it was him? One of the guards saw him cut the husp and run off. Someone's got to do something about that guy. Gas Mask Man. <laughs> it's a clever name. Find Gas Mask Man and talk to him. Okay, I will. I will do that. Looks like... Oh, this is not right down here. Never mind. I thought that it was right down there. What time is it? Okay. You know what, guys? I think I need to stop here. I think I need to stop. Look at our look at the stuff that we're doing. We are covering a lot of area. Okay, so this is over in this section. It's actually pretty far. A couple safe houses near us. Um, where's this one on the map? Oh. Okay. So we'll do this first. And then if I remember, which I will, then I'll come and do the uh gas mask man quest. Destination? Weird. But yeah, okay. Guys, I'm going to wrap it up. Thanks for coming. Uh, That's it, actually. That's all I have to say. Thanks for being here. And we'll be back tomorrow at 4. Unless I have something weird, Uh, we should be good to go at 4 tomorrow. Do I want to hint about the flags? No, because I'm not going to look for them. <laughs> I imagine they're in hard-to-reach places. Like the top of towers. So, yeah. I'm going to go watch uh, Archive 81 for the rest of the night after I get the XCOM videos ready to roll. And uh, I'll schedule another stream for tomorrow at 4 p.m., same time we started today. And we'll go from there, all right? Guys, uh, have a good one. I hope you uh, come back tomorrow. It was a real pleasure to see most of you.